Hi, I'm Breeze Noyal. I'm a PhD student at UNSW Canberra and I'm studying cultural geography. The power to change the unethical side of the fashion industry lies in a better understanding of the processes of producing and especially consuming fashion. This is as traditional modes of thought surrounding production and consumption are reductive, resulting in a lack of understanding of what the consumer's relation to fashion actually is. Through my engagement with designers and the research cluster The Difference Lab, however, the complexities of these processes have become more apparent. When a garment is designed, made or worn, it is done so through a simultaneous engagement of the material, the designer or wearer, the body, and the environmental, political and micro-perceptual data. Anne-Sophie Kuchevelu's works are a clear example of this, which she creates through found objects and then allows to evolve into wearable art or fashion. It is not just the fabric that experiences a creative change though, but also the designers, wearers and observers. The greater the aesthetic encounter we have with fashion, the greater effect it has on us, and thus the more we desire it and are able to overlook its often not so ethical means of production. Taking this into consideration, research into ethical fashion should also pursue ways into enhancing the effectual experience of ethical fashion, while ethical brands should continue to pursue their aesthetic size as brands like The Social Outfit are already doing.